Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Chronic Gold GS Chronicles with Grover Games. I almost said Pokemon Insurgents there for a second. Old habits are gonna die hard here shortly. Um, so I did a little bit messing around in between episodes here. I think I got the time clock and stuff working right because I didn't get the warning this time when we started and I fixed a few other things so I think we should be good to go here. So let's get back to the Professor Elm with these stones and let's get to rolling. Ring ring. Hello, Gigi? It's a disaster. Uh, uh, um, it's just terrible. What should I do? It, it, oh no. Please get back here now. I'll be there as soon as I can, Professor. You know one thing I haven't figured out yet? I haven't figured out what we're gonna name our, name our arrival yet, either. Uh, yeah, we'll fight. We'll, we'll take care of this Caterpie. It's gonna be a quick, it's gonna be a quick, should be a quick one-two hit. One thing I'm kind of curious about. So I, I, I am actually after our last episode, I am strongly considering getting a, going back and getting Cleffa. But the fact that I got the time fixed now, I don't know if we'll ever see one, <laughs> which is unfortunate. But you know, I was kind of considering getting the routes too, and switch gr training that is going to be a pain in the. In the butt if we try to stick around and try and find one. But I, I, I really do kind of want to get a. I do really want to try out Meg. Ah, uh, not a Mega Glade, but just Glade in general, because I never really played with one. Like I tried to once when I first played the. Oh, the Shino, the Gen Four when they first introduced Glade, but I never really got into into him, or really really use utilize him I there's like I said there's quite a few Pokemon that I'm gonna tr try using that I normally don't because I just figured it'd make a, this playthrough a little bit more fun for for us overall plus it it was just the whole uh, whole Glade thing this Glade in general just always intrigued me you know what, we're gonna fight this Caterpie we'll get another level And that way we'll we'll be we should be we should have no issue taking down our rival and that and I just as of before I got distracted I'm trying to figure out what we're gonna name our rival if we get that choice option in here I assume we do I would as I would assume we wouldn't change that aspect of the game either I just know when we we're kid kids we always nickname them like ass wipe and such like that me and my buddy would just cuz we were it was just so funny to us you know as a child it was just so entertaining to us but let's see let's go in here get topped off here and we'll go we'll go we'll go beat up our rival I'm kind of curious if his team's gonna be dull, completely different as well I I hope I hope it is actually like we're not fighting the same like ghost the freaking ghastly Subat setup. You got a Pokemon at the lab. What a waste. That's a Pokemon that's too good for a wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Bastard boy. I would actually probably consider naked, <laughs> nickname naming him that if if it would all fit. Uh shoot. The only thing that that's unfortunate about Oh geez, that you got quite a few defense traps already. Ooh. Come on, Cynthia. There you go, girl. It's a good thing we got that extra level. Cause I don't think we would have survived. That was a pure stroke of luck. Only 240 bucks? If you want to know who I am, I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Give it back, that's my trainer card. Dang, you saw my name. You know, aren't we just the thief as well if we took his trainer card? 
Or or was it just something that happened in the exchange where he's giving us our two hundred forty dollars? It's kind. I always thought that concept was weird. Like I I get the reason why it's in the game. It's just like yeah, you beat me. Here's two hundred. Here's a random two hundred forty bucks. I'll just willingly hand over to you. Ugh, I'm gonna have to. I'm trying to think of a good rival name. But I'm not sh I'm I'm not gonna name him like I, I normally would, just cause, just cause. I figure I matured a little in life. Kind of. Who are you? We are investigating the case of the missing Pokemon here. Rule number one, whoever did it will come back to the site. So you must be Oh my, so you must be the one who did it? Stop there! Gigi has nothing to do with it. I saw it. There was a red haired boy looking into the building. What? You battled a boy like that? He must be the one who did it. Did you ever get his name? Oh, shoot. I thought about naming a red just in fur and bad taste. Ah, why not? Might as well name him red in bad taste. Oh, uh, no. Well, I'll think of a better name. You know what, I'll just... I'm just gonna name him Bears, just cause I know his favorite Pokemon's not in he not in here. We, we gotta include my butt in somehow. It was, his name was Bears. I see, so Bears was his name. Thanks for helping, helping my investigation. My next assignment is to search for this red hair individual. Too bad you guys suck at your job. I'm intrigued about the boy who stole that Pokemon. What was the real reason for him stealing it? I hope the stolen Pokemon is okay. See you later. Not gonna lie, Chris, you feel kind of worthless to me as a character right now. Anyways. GG, this is terrible. Oh yes, what was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? Is that a stone, isn't it? The stone may be something I've never seen. Still, it's just a stone. Mr. Pokemon is always fascinated by stones. Well, since he gave it to us, we might as well find out what secret it holds. I'll keep it for a while to find out about the stone. What? Professor Oak gave you a Pokedex? GG, is that true? That's incredible. He is superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Wow, Gigi. I knew you were a little different. Things are going to be fun. Your Pokemon seem to really like you, so why don't you take the Pokemon Gym Challenge? If you manage to defeat all the gym leaders, you'll eventually challenge the Pokemon League champion. Or not, haha. <laughs> Becoming the champion is not at all easy, but you can certainly challenge Violet City's gym. Gigi, challenging the gym scattered around will be a long journey, but first you need to catch many po Pokemon. Take these Pokeballs. You'll need them to complete the Pokedex. Five Pokeballs. Okay. You put away the Pokeballs. Yep. Just remember to do do your best and never give up. Good luck in your journey, Gigi. You have something else you want to give me? Okay, no. Well, you suck, man. Well, I'm... Can our, does her mother still save money? I can't remember. I assume she does, because we still have a box. You can count on me on your journey, Gigi. Okay, so it does not look like it, which is kind of unfortunate because I, I know she gets like decent thing, items for us, like moonstones and stuff like that. But that's fine, we'll figure it out. And is this the catching tutorial? There you are, GG. Professor Elm is fascinated with your abilities to develop bonds with Pokemon. But what about Pokemon battles? I know, let's have a quick battle. Oh, oh, we're having a battle already? Okay. I was not expecting this. You have a Chikorita? You have a Shinx, okay. Ah, yes. Intimidate. Mmm. With our, already our horrible attack stat. Do we have Leer? I mean, we might as well at least use one. We might even use two, to be honest with ya. I think we'll use two. We're just angry. This is the most riveting Pokemon battle ever. Two, two Pokemon just staring each other down. I'm hoping that... Ooh. Are we gonna white out against... Nope, nope, nope. Oh, we did! I, I am at... <laughs> so...
Huh. That intimidate really hurt us. Yes, yes, go away. Shoo. Shoo! I was not expecting a Pokemon battle. And that... That Shinx really did us in like that. That Intimidate really hurt hurt us, so you know what? We got a Berry Pouch, we might as well... Because I imagine... Oh, nope, no, I don't want to use I want to give her one. Because I don't... Even with us just... Even if we didn't leer the whole time with us tackling, there was no way we were going to win. Because that Intimidate really... An early game Intimidate like that really hurts. I didn't think it would, but... It actually does. Alright, I'm ready this time. Unfortunately. But our first loss doesn't count. It was just a fluke. And the fact we got a berry now we should be fine. But I I refuse to use items in this this run as well. I kinda wanna keep the same concept concept as I did in Pokemon Insurgents, so that way it's at least somewhat, somewhat interesting for gameplay. So we got two Leers off, that should be fine. Let's start tackling this thing. Gosh, that, it's hitting harder than it was before! What changed? Cause it, it, it's actually hitting us harder than it was last time we fought it. Well, at least we, we got through it this time. That's all that matters. Honestly, Cynthia, oh gosh, I can't speak. Cynthia just needs to learn a fire type move. You're pretty good with Pokemon. The more trainers you feed, the more experience your Pokemon will get to level up and learn new moves and even evolve. I have a nice device that was made to make the Experience gain easier. You can have one. Oh, real? Holy cow. Oh, receive some experience. Okay. When the experience share is activated, all your other Pokemon in the party will gain some experience. If they, even if they didn't battle. But be, be aware, you must manually activate it before it works. You're taking the Pokemon Gyms Challenge? Cool. That will also help the Professor Elm's research about bonds with Pokemon. I'm visiting the Pokemon school at Violet City. I know there's a Pokemon gym there. I think it's a good idea if you visit Violet City, too. See you later. Alright. Huh, there's no catching tutorial. That makes me happy. Uh, the basic Pidgey. I honestly would consider catching one, but I... Like I said back in the day, I used to always use Pidgey, even in my first Pokemon game, like Pokemon Yellow, and I'm I wanna stay away from using using one, so. The one thing I do want wanna get is a Cleffa. But I imagine that Cleffa is only a nighttime encounter. But I wonder what else is up here. We've seen Subat up here, but obviously we won't see Subat. Okay, it's giddy. I'm not gonna use it. I'm not. I have no need. I have a no want for a skitty, but I'm just kind of curious what's changed on these routes. A sparrow probably wouldn't be a bad thing to get for temporarily, but we'll we'll see. Oh, I'm guessing that's what took takes Cleffa spot as an ugly buff. Just just no. Just, just no. I'm trying to, I was like gonna say, isn't there usually like a Geodude or something along this route too? I kinda wanna see if there is one. We'll wait for one more encounter and see what we find. Yeah, a Sparrow, okay. A Sparrow, I should say, not a Sparrow. We know it is a Sparrow. Um. We're gonna hold off for now. Because if, if I really want one, I'll come back in my off time, because I think after this episode, I'll take some time to look around the routes and see what see what we can actually find for everything. Can I collect berries again? Yes, I can! After fixing the system time clock thing, I could recollect berries, so that's a little... That's pretty decent for us. Let's go in here and we'll get... 
we'll get Cynthia healed up, so we can go beat Joey up. Or get beat up by Joey. I haven't figured out which yet. Because we did it. We did just get beat up by Chris, but. But literally. I. It's. That's just a. Oh, my controller disconnected. I was like, why am I not moving? There we go. Hmm. Okay, well, this. Okay, that's weird. I'm having a little bit of te technical difficulties, so we'll be right back. Alright, we're back. I'm not sure what happened. It's just like my controller and everything disconnected, and it just kind of went haywire. But I just save stated it quick, and we're we're back now. So let's get let's keep rolling on through the routes here. I kind of wonder what else is in this grass over here, and I wonder if we can still catch that route. Because, like I said, I I actually wouldn't mind using a using a glade. But I don't know if Routes is going to be an encounter that's only going to happen at night or what. I assume it isn't. But you know what happens when you assume. Let's see here. Caterpie. Well, so far we've only seen a Pidgey and a Caterpie on this route. And a Routes. Are you Joey? I just lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. I'm pretty sure this is Joey, if I remember right. Oh yeah, it's totally... Look at Joey. Why do I feel like Cynthia's gonna get beat up pretty bad here? Okay, I guess not. Joey, this oh, okay, there it is. I was like, Joey, if you're not gonna make a hit, if you're not even gonna bother attack me, I didn't realize Ratatata, Ratata is gonna have a quick attack already. Thanks for the money, bud. Top percentage. Oh, okay. I was like, can we not register trainer phone numbers anymore either? Does not look like it, because I do remember that trainer Joey, you could always get his number and like rebattle if you wanted. We're gonna use one of our potions just cause. I've already wiped it out once, we're not doing this, doing this again. If I defeat you, my win rate would be the best of this place. You ever wonder where they come up with these lines for these ch children? I was just say, I don't remember this guy having a like a ladybug. Like back in the day, I remember him having like a Rotata as well. That's actually kind of interesting to see. Or Sentra to be okay. I'm. I remember I I played this game so much I can remember like the first few route battles to a key. And I do remember that this guy had like a Pidgey and a Rotata, not a Sentra or a Letaba. So that is actually, that's actually really cool. I like that already. Are you the lady? Yep, I was gonna say. You're not, you don't want to fight. I was looking for some bug type Pokemon instead I found Trin. Yep, that sounds about right. <clears throat> Dawn, Caterpie. Okay, he, so he's even got like special little Pokeballs too. Of the like netball animation came out when he, that's cool to see. Oh, jeez. Oh, that was a crit. So, I'm curious. Since this game's got, like, revamped trainers and such. Do you think Champion Lance is actually going to have legitimate Dragonites now? That's what I'm kind of curious about. And if he's just going to have a p half his team as Dragonites. I was waiting for that turn one poison, to be honest with you. I kind of held my breath there for a second. I'm like, no. So let's keep rolling on here. I kind of want to get. I kind of want to reach Violet City. This route seems like it's a lot. This grass area seems like it's a lot bigger than normal. We can catch an Avril this turn. 
It's level seven too? I wonder if we can kill it. Nope. <coughs> Kinda expected that, but. If I had a bright, bright ride, I could go to Blackthorn City. Okay. So I remember them saying that HMs are gone and it's like based on the ride system. Oh no. Psst. Hey, you, stop there. Um, please don't battle me, I'm not ready. I do apologize for suddenly stopping you. I'm a humble man who saw you defeating all those low rank trainers. I couldn't resist to offer you these nutritious slowpoke tails for an affordable price. You're an interested lad? What? Illegal? Absolutely no, 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 no. I work for a group of honest dealers who want to offer good items to trainers. Trust me, lad. You don't want to trust me? Think it. Ah! Uh... No! Oh, and an A-Palm too. These things... I have a reoccurring nightmare of these things. Oh, no, 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 no. You are scum of the earth. As long as he never attacks and I can keep hitting like I am, it'll be fine, but I I don't feel like that's gonna last forever. Oh no. I'm like, you don't even have to tail whip, I'm pretty much done. Eh. <laughs> of course. This is the way it would go right now. The worst part is, I have I have more whiteouts in this series already than I have in Insurgents. And Insur I feel like Insurgents was a lot harder. And it's... Oh boy. I am definitely going to have to catch at least one or two more Pokemon before I... Before next episode, but I'm... I was not prepared. I did not think. So we've we're already seeing quite a few changes in this game, which makes me excited. And it also makes me kind of nervous, cause I I I I have put a lot of hours into like gold and silver and crystal, and they and even the remakes were like pretty much the same thing as those games yet in the long like in the main scheme of things. And there's, there's already been two extra trainer battles I never even realized. The one with Chris, and now with this, with this sketchy guy with the A-Palm. And I, and I just, it's just, ugh, just. Every time I come against an A-Palm or Ambi-Palm, and I'm like really caught off guard or unprepared, I always get whooped by them. I'm always getting beaten up by a monkey. Oh boy. Uh, I swear, if we lose again, I, I am just gonna have to say I'm like the worst trainer ever type thing, because. The worst part was we were we were about to win and it you just finally decided to start attacking was the worst part. Like he he legit had one HP left. And it's like, yep, and we're just gonna finish you off now. That's what the frustrating part was about this whole situation. I remember this, I'm telling my partners about this. You'll regret turning down my offer, you hear? Uh, get out of here, man. I, I don't want to deal with you. Okay. So, I'm liking how many berries we're getting right now. Cutie like me will always find a way to attain my stuff. I know a move called Covet that uses cute tacticians to steal the item health. Woo! Can- Woo, Cynthia! Sweet! We're gonna have to start stealing stuff. Coming to Thebes.
I mean... You know what? We gotta teach Cynthia that already, because I'm sure she's already very disappointed at us, as I am myself. Okay, so we got a TM case. Um, I think we... Yeah, I think we can just get rid of Tackle, because... Oh, yeah. Just get rid of Tackle. Frustration should hit harder for quite a while, even over that other Moon Covet to get free items, but... Oh! We can get a Till... So, I am... The biggest thing I am liking about this game already is that besides, like, the normal route encounters, we can also find all the other generations, which is actually really cool, so we're gonna be able to... Okay, my heart's yeah. So, with... With the way these, with the way they got the route encounters and stuff designed, I am really liking it so far. Actually, I should catch a spell sprout. I wonder if that person's still there with the onyx. Let's see how hard we hit with that. Oh, that's not too bad. We'll just use this just in case, because I don't want to accidentally kill it. So actually, it's doing about the same damage from the way it looks. Let's get a, let's get this thing caught here, and we're gonna go see if we can get that up, see if we can get an onyx yet from that one trainer that's in this town here. But back to what I was saying, the one thing I'm really enjoying is these, like, customized routes, so to speak. And there we go, we got Ember. You know, we'll just get rid of Frustration right away, because it looks like... That move and frustration are doing about the same amount of damage, so I'm I'm fine with get rid of frustration, and we could always reteach it if we need to. So I'm liking the oh oh that's right. I'm so used to insurgents of just um having to type the name on the keyboard but just the fact that we can go to the routes and we can find gen 3 pokemon as well as other generations which is really cool we were trained hard to take on the okay let's keep rolling okay apparently oh hey there kid are you taking the pokemon gym challenge that's great I'm Prim Primo. You know me from the t my TV show, the show Me Show. I see you haven't earned a single badge. You'll need to catch plenty of Pokemon before you take the gym challenge. Have some special Pokeballs. This will make the task easier. A rare ball that specially made to come right in event of some sort. So, what is the true story behind Premier Balls? Because I never realized. Like, I remember they were introduced in, like, Gen 3, and whenever you bought, like, 10 balls, you got one for free. What- what's the catch with them? Heh, <laughs> catch. But, seriously, though. I honestly do not know, and I should look into that, because I'm actually kind of curious now. Don't forget to always have enough Pokeballs in your bag, so you never miss the opportunity to catch Pokemon. I'll go back to Ro Golden Rod City to record my next TV episode. See you later. So that's... So there's already quite a few new things in here. And I know this is the house where we normally trade with the guy for an onyx, right? Um. Is, is the guy gone now? Because I could have sworn it's this house. Well, first things first, let's, let's get healed up so I don't accidentally go into someone's house and get blindsided. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. Would you like to heal your Pokemon? Yeah. We hope to see you again. Okay. Yep. What do you have to say? I really want to pick Pikachu. Um, so I'm training my Clefairy for one. Okay. I wouldn't, but. What do you have to say, lady? Show. Have you ever watched the famous Show Me Show? It's. <laughs> okay. That's that's such a weird name for a show. Show Me Show. 
So we're gonna skip over to school for now. I swear there is. A, I swear that was the house unless they moved them. Hello there. Do you happen to have a power world? Okay, so that's new. I don't have a poly world, but we're gonna, we'll keep, I don't think I'll ever use a Jinx though, but I think we might be at, I think we're, we're gonna be wrapping up today's episode here everyone, I'm, I think I'm gonna take some time off screen here and see if I can find us a few new pokey friends, see if I can find a male routes, cause like I said, I really, I really do want to use a Gallade and I think it'd be fun. But we're going to save the game here. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel. If you're enjoying the content, please subscribe so you can stay up to date to the latest series. Above all else, I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day. And most of all, thanks for watching.